la la la. Don't do that. So a lot of people don't know how to use Photoshop or think it's so hard to do stuff and it's really not. It's really easy and I'm just gonna show you basic stuff you can do in literally five seconds. So, here we go. Okay, so let's say you take a beautiful selfie picture, like, and you're like, but wait, oh, I have a fucking freckle on my forehead and you hate freckles. Hey, hey, hey. So use your good old friend, the spot healing brush. So you can just, boom, click it, boom, freckles gone. No more freckle. Oh, I don't like this freckle too. Or these little zits, or this one on my nose. Or if you're like, oh, I don't like the bags under my eyes. Gone. Oh, I don't like the wrinkles on my forehead. It's just making more. I don't know why that's doing like that. There. Boom. That was easy. That was in like 10 seconds. Let's see it before and after here. Look at that. Look at that difference. Who's this model? So it's before, after, before, after. 10 seconds, easy, that you don't even know easy. how to, you click one tool and you're clicking away. So let's say you're in a group picture, I was by myself so I couldn't do anything about that. Let's say you took a group picture with a bunch of friends and you set up a tripod or you like rested your camera and just took a bunch of pictures. And everyone likes one picture but you're, oh, you're blinking in it. But if you took a picture where you're not blinking, you can just use a good old lasso tool. Just steal this cute little face. Oh my, that already like worked. I literally pasted it and it literally looks pretty good. And you just uh, do a little get your eraser tool. Get a little feather brush. And just erase. Kablam. Now you're not blinking. I'm obviously not doing a really good job, but it's just to show you how easy it is. That was easy. Easy. Done. Okay, let's say you're like, oh, I love those pictures where people do, like it looks like you have a clone. That's so easy. That was Set easy. Set up a tripod. Take three pictures where you're in different spots. It's easier if you're not like, if you're in completely different spots where you wouldn't be touching and frame. So you can just lasso to yourself, cut yourself out of this picture. Boom, copy, go back to this picture, paste it in. First, let me adjust the brightness a little bit. That match. No, nope, that's not what I meant. Then you use your good old blendy blend. Oh my God! There's another me in the background. How cool is that? How easy that was, was that? Easy. I'll do another one. This will be even easier. Just the brightness and contrast so it matches. Good old erasing tool. So once you get that matching, you just gotta feather the edges a little bit. Boom, look. Almost fell out of my chair. Three of me. Two seconds. Okay, so let's say you're like, oh, whoops. Oh, look at this cute picture of me, but uh, I don't want this Avengers poster in the background. Like, who likes Avengers 2? <laughs> so you just grab your lasso tool and just go around it like that. Boom, then you hit Control Delete. That brings up Content Aware Fill. And you can just hit OK. Usually it does a decent job. That's not bad. It left a little weird thing here, but like got rid of the poster. That's all that mattered, right? No, that's not all that mattered. If you want to just do weird shit with your face. If you're like, if you're like, oh, I wish my eyes were a little smaller. Like, oh, my nose was a little straighter. So if you go into filter and then liquify, you got all these tools right here. So you can change the size of your brush. It's way too small and that's a little too big. Just right, okay. So now if you're like, oh, I wish my eyes were smaller. You can just use this little shrinky button Give a few clicks, look up. That's the size of eyes I want. You can just do weird shit. You can do whatever you want. If you're like, oh, I want my nose to be straighter. 
you just grab, you use this, this forward warp tool. You just click where you want to move and you move it. But definitely don't move it like that. You can make your nose bigger and smaller. Okay, scrunch it in a bit. Oh my God, look how cute. But if you're like, no, I want those big Kylie Jenner lips. You just up that brush size, cover those lips, you can go bam. Boom. Beautiful. Those, no. This is what you want. I'm not saying you have to make yourself look like this. I'm just saying it's really easy that was to. Easy. It's not hard. Photoshop is very easy. That was easy. I just want to show people how easy. That was easy. So you can be like, bam, look at. That's what I looked like before. Now look how good I look. <laughs> Anyways. So comment down below if you want me to try something in Photoshop and I can, if you guys like this video, I'll do more Photoshop stuff. And if you don't, then I'm never going to do it again and I'll just cry again. So if you liked it, thumbs up. If you didn't, don't thumbs down. Just don't watch anymore or watch our other videos. Okay. Bye.